Noun. Noun is a part of speech refers to words that are used to name persons, things, animals, places, ideas, or events. Examples. Tom Hanks is very versatile. Tom Hanks is noun, refers to a name of a person. Dogs can be extremely cute. Dogs is noun, because it names an animal. It is my birthday. The word birthday is a noun which refers to an event. There are different types of nouns, proper, common, concrete, abstract, count, non-count, collective. Proper. The proper nouns always start with a capital letter and refers to specific names of persons, places, or things. Examples, Tom, John, Mary Bella, Albert's Pizza. Common. The common nouns are the opposite of proper nouns. These are just generic names of persons, things, or places. Examples, car, pizza shop, home, man, kid. Concrete. The concrete noun is refers to noun which you can perceive through your five senses, like seen, touched, heard, smelled, or tasted. Examples, folder, sand, board. Abstract. The abstract nouns are those which you can't perceive through your five senses. Examples, happiness, grudge, bravery. Count. Count noun refers to anything that is countable and has a singular and plural form. Examples, kitten, video, ball. Non-countable. Non-countable nouns refers to nouns that we cannot count, like rice, flour, water. They need to have counters to quantify them. Examples, 2 kilo of rice, a cup water, 100 gram of flour. Collective. The collective noun refers to a group of persons, animals, or things. Example, faculty, group of teachers, class, group of students, committee, group of people. Pronoun. A pronoun is a part of a speech which functions as a replacement for a noun. It is often used to avoid the need to repeat the same noun again and again. There are eight types of pronouns. They are personal, demonstrative, indefinite, interrogative, possessive, relative, reflexive, and intensive. Personal pronoun. Personal pronouns are used to replace the names of people or things. There are three group. First person, I, we. Second person, you. And third person, he, she, it, and they. Demonstrative pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns are used to point to specific people or things, such as this, that, these, and those. Indefinite pronouns. Indefinite pronouns refer to people or things in general, like anyone, anything, everyone, and everything. Interrogative pronouns. Interrogative pronouns are used to ask questions. They include who, whose, what, whom, and which. Possessive pronouns. Possessive pronouns show ownership or possession. They include mine, yours, his, hers, its, theirs, and ours. Relative pronouns. Relative pronouns are used to connect clauses or phrases together, such as who, whom, whose, that, and which. Reflexive pronouns. Reflexive pronouns refer back to the subject of the sentence. They include myself, yourself, himself, herself, itself, ourselves, yourselves, and themselves. Intensive pronouns. Intensive pronouns are used for emphasis, such as myself, yourself, himself, herself, itself, ourselves, yourselves, and themselves. If you have any questions, please leave your comments in the comments section below. Thanks.